Hi yo, Weapon Bar Club. Who? Uh, what happened here? <sighs> so this part was a messy part. There was a sofa and a lot of rubbish and building materials. I threw it all out and made this gaming table area and the curtain. And behind the curtain, there is my chaos. Chaos, chaos. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. A lot happened since the last video. A lot happened. But why? Because <laughs> I needed a change. And I needed a break. If you wondered where I was. I'm a game master in the D&D campaign now. In my homebrew D&D campaign. Um... It's about islands and uh, Caribbean-like ocean. And today I'm building a new DM screen slash backdrop slash encounter, vertical encounter, a rock cliff face backdrop thing from Styrofoam. I'm going 160 uh, in width, whole table width. It's two tables, 160 meters by 160. Um, that's about five foot by five foot, I guess. Cutting out a rough shape with a knife, using the offcut to bulk up the bottom section. I'm using acrylic caulking to glue everything together. Yeah, flattening out the stuff with a piece of styrofoam. The thinner it is, the faster it sets. But if it's too thin, it doesn't stick. If it's too thick, it takes ages and uh, you know. Carving in some basic cracks. Yeah, styrofoam is cheap. This was a, a off, uh, yeah, rubbish styrofoam. Some toothpicks to give some more stability. Plaster, PVA, water mix. Really wet, too wet. Blub, blub, blub. It's a little bit too wet in this uh, first batch. Smearing it around with my hands. Getting dirty, getting my hands dirty. Yeah, some rubble. If it sticks, it sticks. If not, doesn't matter. You know the drill. I covered everything in this PVA plaster mix. The last batches were a little bit thicker and I just smacked them on there and used the spatula to get rid of my finger shapes. Make it a little bit more rough. So this is what we have now. There was no color in the mix, in the plaster mix. So it's a nice light gray. Adding some washes. The uh, bright yellow and the brown and the gray. Some dry brushing, like beige tone. And in the end, some sift earth. Hachi. Yeah, that's it. On purpose, I did no bushes, trees and stuff like that, because that would limit it to a certain scale. And I don't want that. Um, if I put it in the far distance for a photo, maybe um, it's a smaller scale. And if it's up front, I can use it as a regular 28 millimeter scale. Yeah, let's see how it looks with the curtain drawn back. Getting rid of the chaos. DM screen. <laughs> Backdrop. Vertical encounter. Like... Uh, Joe from Encounter Terrain does them. Let's see what the players say. See ya!